All right, now that we've got the game and all running, remember this is Linux. You can do this in Windows as well with with the same steps. But yeah, the first thing we want to try to do is change a texture. And that's the easiest thing you can do in this uh, engine. That's changing a texture for, for someone, for a solder or whatever. Okay, let's close this. Sorry, I got it open. It's not supposed to be open. Um, need to close a lot of windows, sorry. You know, I'm in Linux, but anyways, I have to close windows. <laughs> well, and, well, this one stays here, stays here, stays here, stays here. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, we got the mod version. And we got the actual attachments. This is the original one, and this is the one I will send to everyone who tries to modify and uh, liberate some special forces, I guess. And what you want to do, but you can get it from Perforce. If you are a friend of mine, on, well, and you're inside Creative Woman Studios, you will have access to Perforce. And in Perforce, you will get the uh, actual build, the act latest actual build that you can use to do more, uh, anyways. Okay, let's begin. Uh, to begin with, we will try to we will try to create a in the mod version a new texture for for the soldier. Okay, let's go do it. Um, okay, yeah, let's try try to launch a mod version. Hmm. Okay. All right. So, the first thing we will do when while it's loading it doesn't take a lot of time, but yeah, yeah, t change the, the texture as I said, but we will create a, a fancy uh, green 10 uh, texture. Let's go, let's go. Let's win that it's also in, win in Windows as well. We need to create our texture with the same uh, proportions uh, in pixels uh, 4 for the uniform yeah, let's go first let's look at our solder which is this it's our hike okay and this is the, the solder, the, our solder and this is usually the texture we use Okay, hold on. Uh, vest. Sort of search for vest. Vest in here. Um, in here, we should see the texture somewhere or the material that this texture uses. But I don't see it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Material? Not. Ah, it's here. No, 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 no. Where's the material? Oh, me. Ah, okay. In here, this is a, this is a, this is the the texture we want to change. So we change the whole texture. Okay, we go here, and we see this thing. This thing, um, and in here, yeah, the material. This is the material global color texture texture. Here, this is the texture we want to use, but I think it's this one. I'm not sure. Well, uh, let's. Hmm. I really hate the uh, content browser in Unreal Engine Five. It's. It's not so. Hmm. It's not so good, in my opinion. Because it, it is really, really an annoying sometimes. But yeah, whatever. Uh, let's try to change these textures. And we will try to change it on the actual package build. Let's go. Okay, um, the first thing you want to do is take the proportions. It is... This one is... 1K, 
and this one is 254 254 I'm uh, 56 56 256 and yeah we will attend them and see if we have any good effects in the game. As long as I know there's no two of them in here. Uh, yes. Yeah, there's only one. Uh, Ah, there's two. But we will replace everything. So we need to get uh, two, two textures of this kind. Uh, okay, let's go. Let's do it. We go to here. New. 256 by 256. Create. Okay. Okay. And we will fill it with color. I don't remember where. Uh, this one. No, not this one. This one. Well, well, let's create a like a World War II communist uh, communist pattern. Made it a little bit more lighter. I don't know how to make it lighter. I right, like this. Like this, I guess. Like this. Okay. No, oh, okay, like this. Yeah. Mm, maybe a little bit more, a little bit more dark, darker. Yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, I, I think this is the good one. Like, like, like this. All right, yeah. Or, whatever, well, a little bit more. And that's it. I <laughs> know, oh, perfect. Well, let's go make them the time shoulders. Um, so now we got this export as, and we call it. We have to call the same name of as the, or maybe no, we don't need to call the same name. But ideally, to be called something we recognize, recognize two, well, two, five, five, six. New mod solder solder camo export export now change the size and hold on one K, it was one K but I don't remember how much how much is much here not on R yeah, here Okay, I'm gonna, this is 1024. 1024. 1024. 24. Okay. Okay, scale. Now we export and we call it 1K. 1K. It's a lot, but never mind. No, I'm kidding. Not that. Okay, now, now we will go here. And uh, you see, you see that uh, this is the texture, right? We're going to change it. So we import new file with new file, and we don't. We go to our home folder, desktop, and we hit this one because it's just a one K, right? Yeah, it's a one K, and we substitute it. And yeah, now we see the changes already. Nice, huh? Uh, uh well, I don't, I don't remember if this is the right version uh, of Unreal. Well, the game ISF, I uh, guess. Hmm. Showing file manager. Yeah, mod version. Okay, this is a mod version. Good. Now we go and take this one and we also do the same thing. We go here and import for this new file. 
we go to desktop no see i don't know why it points to there and yeah do you know uh desktop and we see this one and we open and we import okay now it's good now uh what is it doing what save all and now we're going to create um get the files get the so let's get the files first we need to package or just cook content and with cooking content we will get the the, the things we need so let's cook it now um we need to as well build our own version of LSF, which i already have but that's cool isn't it um where is it uh in packaging well this version of lsf should you sh you can get it from steam already um we go packaging 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 pack oh, packaging here but well, it's my folder to send builds and in here we should see our lsf uh, this is one the latest version in my case and in here oh, i forgot to no no it's good it's good but we will get to replace now the files and get our our, our uh, results but we can test this one and see if it works and if it works well obviously Okay, it it changed it finished the thing. Yeah. Okay, okay, now, uh, now that we we have this, now we we get our mod files. How to get our mod files? It's pretty easy. We go to uh, the the mod version we uh, we did, and um, we should see cooked folder okay this is a cooked folder good now in here we have a we should see the we should get the files we, we created okay this you see this you asset you bulk and you exp i'm sorry but i don't remember um i don't really remember what was the the right file the the file that would you have to change in order to change the this thing but we will try with everything but first let's make a folder like original files for camouflage for original lsf one okay now we got this mod files here these are the mod files but we need to change the files but hold on we need to make a backup first because it's necessary and um, I don't remember where is the folder contained in this it doesn't tell us so but um, anyone no, maybe one. it doesn't tell us so but uh, uh, it, location ah 2d textures all right, now let's take this and t get it to the backup place. Backup. It's not a lot of work. I'm just improvising a lot. Uh, I'm not. This was not planned. I mean, not even scripted. Not even make a script out of it. So this is a little bit of a mess, I guess you could say. Okay, now, and let's see if it works. Because I don't even know if it works, but yeah. Uh, you go to SF uh, main root folder. What is it? Tears. Uh, TSI? Uh, here. No, this TSI stands for true side iron, true iron sides. But I don't know why I finally called this, became this, but yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I guess it's good. Okay, now. Um, and one and now place all the stuff in here this is the mod ones i think yeah if we go here 
are, well, I don't know if it's remote ones, but anyways, yeah, these are remote ones. I mean, will a anyone? And this, we will create a, a folder. <coughs> we'll create a folder, uh, and we will call it mod of camouflage camo uh what about you so yes i know it's fine um uh, what is it there's a folder create a folder where you oh here 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 we control c control b and let's do the magic step the final step copy and paste our good way i guess uh, it's not letting me paste, but it's good because I know where's the folder at, where's the camouflage at. And yeah, let's this is the mod. Let's try to copy and paste. Okay, okay, uh, yeah, yeah. here, boom. Replace all. Will it work? I don't know. Let's try. No, it's not this one. It's this one. And we'll go to the console command, to the terminal, and let's try it again. Yeah, that's the one. We'll work on it. Welcome, Welcome to Fort Woods. I am yeah, the instructor it works. Centurion there are time. But it, it is night time. Yeah, I don't want to, I want to go home too, dude. Shut up. <laughs> and yeah. As you can see, there are time. They're like... I don't know. I guess uh, sand soldiers. And with this, you could make a mod of of uh, uh, army man. You could make a uh, I don't know everything. I guess. And that's it for the modding tutorial on how to take sense textures. It works, it's cool. The, um, and I don't know, you can make a, um, um, uh, an army man like toy soldiers mod. You could make a um, um, Ellen's mod. You could make a. <laughs> that, an Ellen's mod would be cool. You can make. Uh, but if you're, if you, only with the textures, because I, I haven't explored any other uh, modes, like, yeah, like, like, it's actually real good, the uh, camouflage. And yeah. Um, I want to go home and <laughs> And that's it. Cheers.